Action News, Delaware Valley's leading news program with Gary Papa, Dave Roberts, and Jim Gardner. Expansion plans at Philadelphia International Airport will apparently end up in court, and the plaintiffs would be both Tinicum Township and Delaware County. Here's that story from Action News reporter John Rollins. Something you might not know. Two-thirds of Philadelphia International is not in Philadelphia. Most of it is actually next door in Tinicum Township, Delaware County. The airport has signaled it wants to grow and is eyeing another 230 acres in Tinicum. Tinicum today said no thanks that such an expansion would cost it dearly. It and the county are headed to court. Here is what the airport looks like currently. If it builds a new east-west runway along the river, it would have to move the big UPS facility to the west. That's on the 230 acres. Tinicum officials blasted the expansion today, claiming it would be devastating, displacing thousands of workers and forcing 300 residents, or 7% of the township's population, out of their homes. And that's just going to tear, tear it apart, and, and we're, losing, we're losing a bit of Americana and it's just never going to come back if we, if, we, if we destroy it now. To keep that from happening, the township is turning to a law written during the early days of aviation. It's claimed Philadelphia must get permission from both the county and township before it can buy land in Tinicum to expand an airfield. A city of the first class cannot acquire land in Delaware County without the consent of Tinicum Township and without the consent of county. But along this targeted street, residents were skeptical the expansion can be stopped. It's going to come no matter what eventually. I think it's, it's just a matter of time. Philadelphia had no comment saying it had just received the lawsuit, but in the past it has said the expansion would create thousands of jobs and reduce airport delays. Critics, though, vowed a fight arguing instead of building more runways here, some Philadelphia flights should move to smaller regional airports in Allentown and Delaware. John Rollins, Channel 6 Action News.